What up? It's Chris from LaserLemming.com, and Hideo Kojima is out. He's out. He's leaving Konami. He's the director of the Metal Gear Solid franchise, the Metal Gear franchise. He started it all. He is the voice of Solid Snake and Big Boss and the rest of the crew. And Metal Gear Solid 5 looks to be like his last Metal Gear game for real this time. He is uh, reportedly leaving Konami on April 1st. At least uh, his contract is supposed to end in December. But uh, I guess he's bouncing not too long from now. He is. He's, he stated that, don't worry, I'm fully committed to finishing this game and making it my best game yet. But him and Konami doesn't seem like they're friends anymore. In fact, Konami is removing his name from the game, reportedly. Uh, they're pulling out the whole Hideo Kojima game from Metal Gear Solid 5, and supposedly now they're retroactively going back to previous Metal Gear games and pulling his name off of those too. Which, I don't know how they do that, maybe just on digital versions of the game, they'll uh, just release a new updated copy that doesn't uh, pimp out the Hideo Kojima name. I guess there's bad blood. Uh, supposedly, and this is kind of where I get murky here, but I guess Konami went through some restructuring recently, and uh, maybe there's a bit of a power play going on there, but Hideo Kojima, he's out, and he is taking his team with him, supposedly. Uh, the, what is it, Kojima Games? Something like that. You know, his crew. His, his uh, Metal Gear crew. He's taking them with him. It looks like it. At least it sounds like it. And Konami's like... Fuck. Because uh, when this news first broke, Konami went on damage control and said, Don't worry, don't worry. Kojima's not going anywhere. He and Konami are going to keep on making awesome Metal Gear games. No more. They went ahead and said, uh, Yo, uh, Hideo Kojima's still working on Metal Gear Solid 5, and we're going to keep on making Metal Gear games without him. And uh, we're working and looking for new talented people to uh, create Metal Gear games. Shit. Shit, so, uh, I mean, this is like a, a Mario game without Miyamoto involved. And, really, Miyamoto hasn't uh, been as hands-on with Mario as he used to in the past, but uh, Metal Gear is Kojima. Kojima is Metal Gear. And so, without him at the reins, I think um, I'm not that interested in Metal Gear. But who knows, maybe uh, Konami will make interesting Metal Gear games without him. But what is Konami without Metal Gear? They had that PES Soccer and uh, Silent Hill games, I guess? But Metal Gear was really their big <laughs> hardcore gamer franchise, and without the uh, head creator at the reins, who gives a shit? Because, I mean, you know, uh, Platinum made Metal Gear Rising, which was an action game, and it was different than regular Metal Gear games, but, you know, had some of that same flavor, and it was decent, it was good, but you know, it wasn't a traditional Metal Gear game. And, you know, Kojima has been stating for over a decade now that he was done with the Metal Gear franchise. But this time it looks like it's for real. It's for real. And, you know, I'm happy for him just because uh, this might be the only way that this dude's ever going to work on a new IP ever again. So, you know, good for him. Uh, Konami, whatever, dudes. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't care. Uh, you know, the Metal Gear franchise is a love-hate relationship for me. I love how much detail they put into the games. You could really do a lot of shit. And uh, when you're actually playing the games, it's pretty fun. Some of the cutscenes, God sakes, it just gets too long, drawn out, ridiculous, and sometimes boring. But I'm still uh, looking forward to Metal Gear Solid 5. I enjoyed Ground Zeroes. You should check that out if you haven't already. Uh, also, you should subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And let me know what you think about Kojima exiting the franchise for real this time. Subscribe for more if you haven't already, and I don't know if I've said that, but uh, check out this channel and subscribe for more if you haven't already. Also, uh, let me know in the comment section below what do you think, and I'll see you next time.